Thank you so much to Wix.com for sponsoring this video today. If you want to build an amazing website, go check out Wix.com. Thanks Wix, you the best. Hello guys and welcome to another studio vlog. Um, it's actually Tuesday today and I normally start my studio vlogs on a Monday but yesterday we were so busy, me and Emily, working on your orders because obviously Christmas is in full swing and in the new year I definitely need a new way of organising my business. I'm going to have to start bulk making things but now we're just kind of swimming in thick gloopy water at the minute trying to get everything um, out to you guys so thank you very much for keeping me very busy. Um, in this week's vlog I would really like to send off some new enamel pin designs for the new year so I won't be releasing these designs during Christmas I'll be releasing them in the new year and I need to get them sent off now because obviously it's December it can take up to six weeks for the designs to come for the pin designs so I need to get to work on that so that's going to be the plan for this week I also need to order new backing cards and I've got some more enamel pins coming today which includes my pudding snow dog which hasn't been released yet and I also have just received a big batch of gingy enamel pins which which is exciting but I feel like they're gonna sell out pretty fast because I've had a lot of messages about them so we're gonna unbox the new enamel pins that I've got in the post as well then I'll need to make all the backing cards for them and I also need to upload some YouTube videos and finish off my Hewan pen tablet review so we've got a lot to do this week uh, so instead of talking to you guys I'm gonna have to get going the first thing we're gonna do is start on orders and making some stuff oh that was my bag. Thanks, Em. Um, coffee time. <laughs> Someone actually wrote on uh, YouTube, no one cares about your cheap ass coffee. <laughs> but I do, I love coffee. So yeah, busy day ahead. Let's get to work on some orders. And then let's get into the studio vlog. Love you, goodbye. just creating products for the orders and then the postman arrived with all my enamel pins so it's the first time I'm going to be able to see the pudding dog snowman pin which I'm really really excited about so it's the first time we're going to see it together so let's crack it off and shall we oh I ordered so many and I can see my pudding dog through the bubble wrap so the first batch is my Let's Cougar pin. These have been sold out for about three weeks and they're super popular so I ordered some more in. So let's crack these up and shall we? So this is the Let's Cougar pin. Turned out pretty cute. Just like these are a reorder so these sold out really really quick. But uh, so I reordered them and they turned out adorable. Let's see what else. My marshmallows. <laughs> Can't get into it. And there's my marshmallow dude. Yay. So that's my marshmallow one, which I'm very happy about. I can't remember if I ordered 50 or 100 of them, but I'm gonna have to start ordering like 200s worth. Oh, and he's pudding, the pumpkin dog, because he, this is the third batch of puddings that I've actually ordered, because he keeps selling out. Here we go. Cute. 
So he's in little rose gold and he's got his little pumpkin outfit on. I'm excited to see these ones. Oh my goodness! These are my pudding snowman dogs and they look adorable. Oh my goodness! So I got these ones in black nickel. The last ones are rose gold, the pumpkin ones. And look at him. Oh my goodness, is that the cutest little thing you've ever seen? Look at him. He is so flipping cute. Let's put him next to his pumpkin outfit and see how they look together. Oh my goodness, they are freaking adorable. What do you think? What's your favourite outfit for him? Do you like the pumpkin one or do you like the snowman? I actually think that I love the snowman one because I love the colours of the blue and the pink. Let me know in the comments below which pumpkin dog you prefer. So yay! I hope you enjoyed my enamel pin unboxing video. Uh, I like opening them with you guys because it's fun to see. Oh, also, we got a new batch of gingies. And there he is. The little Gingy, he's been super popular in my Etsy store this year and he is going to be a permanent fiction, a permanent character in Catnip's little world and he is going to keep going because we just can't forget him about him. Gingies are not just for Christmas, they are for life as well. Okay, so I've finished all of my backing cards and uploaded them to the website and now i just need to order them all and it says if i order them now it will come by thursday so hopefully these should be in my etsy store this weekend good morning guys and happy wednesday today is my client work day and it's also my youtube filming day so that's pretty much it client work and youtube filming day i've got the lights off and my lamp on and i'm creating a nice cozy setting so i can sit and get to work on the client work if i have time at the end of the day i'll also make some new stickers and list them in my etsy store uh, they're just basically the gingy stickers but all on one sheet like the same the same design all on one sheet because uh, i know that people like to see that so let's get to work on client work it's not going to be very interesting filming today so i'm very sorry so yeah see you soon Okay, so I've cleared everything away and now I'm going to pop to the post office because that little bag over there is all your orders so I need to go take that to the post office before 3pm. So I'm going to go there, then I'm going to have my break and then finally we're going to get to work on some enamel pins and stickers. Let's go, shall we?
so I've just finished making some batches of new stickers for my Etsy store and I've uploaded them to my Etsy and I just made this cute little Gingy here who's asleep and then the present Gingy and then another one with the jumper. I basically made the sets off, I didn't do any new illustrations, I made the sets off the original one like this because people wanted to see more of these on one sheet. So I decided to offer it. So now on each sheet there's like just one illustration so they can use it in planners and stuff so that's what i've been working on today and it is now six o'clock and uh i'm leaving in an hour because i have to be home by seven for tea so sorry if the crickets are really loud in the background there uh so i'm gonna get a sketchbook out and i'm gonna design my first enamel pin design and then i'll probably call it a day today so let's get the ipad out shall we Okay, so I finished the little guy and what I did was I basically put it into Photoshop and to get the Pantone libraries, I have the colour swatch libraries set up for Pantone coated, I think it is. And all I do is I go to the eyedropper tool, click on the colour that I really liked um, in Procreate and then say it's a slightly different colour, then I go to colour libraries and it picks me a Pantone colour closest to the colour that I designed it with. So then I select that colour and then colour this, like change the colour on my design and I make a note of it. And if I don't like it, I'll obviously adjust it. But I'm really happy with how it turned out. It turned out way quicker than I thought it was going to be. So he was a lot quicker than I thought he was going to be to design. So I'm very, very happy. I'm really excited to get him. I'm going to keep one of these little guys for myself. I keep the first pin I ever open of new designs. I always keep them. And I'm really excited to keep this little guy because he's really cute. So I'm going to send an email to my manufacturer to get a price. Um, and probably gonna order him and he's gonna be my kind of new product enamel pin launch in the new year. I also wanted to do a baby shark enamel pin but I'm not really sure how a baby shark will sell. What would you think? Let me know in the comments below if you would like to see a baby shark enamel pin. But yeah, the sorting hat is something that I've definitely wanted for quite some time now. So I'm going to send him off and then I'm going to finish up for the day. Hey, my instant print delivery has arrived for my enamel pin. So let's unbox them and double check that everything is okay together, shall we? I really like instant print because they're really, really quick and they're nice and cheap. And they always come in nice... Whoa, you slept there. Really nice boxes as well. Yay! So they give you these, which are like business card things, because I order business card packs of prints, and they give you these to go at, um, I'm going to end up with just like loads of these, which is a bit of a nightmare. Maybe next time on my order, I can just leave a note to say, don't put these in. But these are pretty good if you're just starting out and you've got business cards for yourself. They're nice. And I got the premium quality this time, so not the economy. Uh, it was one pound extra to get the premium, so I went for that. Let's open them, shall we? Ooh, these are super nice quality. And let's see what it looks like with Gingy on there, shall we? Very nice. These are a lot thicker. They're very nice quality. Mmm, so nice to touch. <laughs> so this was the other backing card 
let me get you in focus there this was the other backing card for Gingy, and as you can see he's slightly deeper and he has got a new logo and i don't know if you're going to be able to tell but this one is a lot thicker this one bends a lot easier than this one this is a lot more sturdy and thick so yeah i'm really happy with how he turned out you can't see him but he looks really cute so that's my octopus one my octopus is gold blade so let's put octi on it's a really nice quality card oh it looks so cute that's what octi looks like i don't know if you can see because he's super shiny but that's what Octi looks like on his new backing card. So there's Gingy and Octi. He looks really cute. And I just put like these little bubble things on it. These little bubbles and it kept it really simple. And it looks nice because it draws attention to the enamel pin. One thing I will say is this size. This is going to annoy me because it's not on centre. Um, the one thing I will say, business card size is perfect. Before this, they were bigger than this and there was a lot of space that was just wasted. Oh, my phone's ringing. Look at the mess I've made. What a mess. But yeah, these are all the plastic tubs that Instant Print sends. So next time, I'm probably going to leave a note just to say don't send me these. I mean, it's a lovely gesture, especially if you're the first time customer. But when I order quite a lot, obviously I don't want to be stuck with them. But I'll probably put enamel pins in here and send them off to my customers. Just as a little gift and to reuse them rather than chucking them out. And then these are all the pins that I've got. What do you think? Which one is your favourite one? I have to admit, my favourite is Pudding. Look at him in his little snowman outfit. Uh, so yeah, these are all them. All I need to do now is photograph them all and upload them to my Etsy because obviously they've changed slightly. My uh, marshmallow hasn't changed but the backing card has so I probably will get away with that. And obviously I need to photograph this little guy honestly the video doesn't even do it justice how cute this is in person it's one inch and oh, honestly so adorable uh so yeah i'm gonna clear all this mess away and try and find a new home for them and then i'm gonna get back to work on orders so let's go shall we I've done all the posts and everything and tidied away for the day and now I have to edit this studio vlog. I'm so sorry if it's kind of boring at the minute. I can't, I don't have as much time to sit down and film all the nice bits but I hope you still enjoy them anyway. And now it's time to open the goodies you guys have sent me in the post. I'm so excited. A lot of people are saying that it's nice to support other handmade artists and I totally agree. So this way it gets them out. So let's start with this one who has really, really nice hand lettering. Look at that. This is amazing. And this is from Lucy Carter. So I'm excited to open it. Look at the packaging on this. She's actually hand wrote this. And this is from Leaf Lane Studio. Oh my goodness. It's like a, a hand painted art print with Sion for Catherine. <gasps> that is beautiful. And she's even done it in pastel pink. Can you see? That's all hand painted. Check that out. It's such beautiful quality, I can't even believe you can do this. Thank you so much Lucy and your letter is so so nice. She wrote this letter, she says she specialises in um, in wedding stationery but she's trying to broaden her spectrum of um, designs and stuff and this is something that you can get personalised in her store so she can customise and personalise a letter in your store and she hand paints them. I just, 
it's just amazing that that's hand painted and all the details in it it's just crazy it's so beautiful this one has come in a super shiny bag look at this oh what is this oh my goodness what on earth is this look how gorgeous this is wrapped oh my goodness and then look at this look how beautiful the graphic design is on this oh my gosh and it's like in rose gold foil that is stunning these would make gorgeous christmas gifts imagine giving someone this oh my goodness that is stunning and i love so inside this little bag are these little iridescent hearts and a rose gold ring with a pink bow on it oh my goodness and then she's put some of the little iridescent hearts inside the package as well this ring was made for me oh my goodness what have i done to deserve that and a little it's a bow with the little love hearts and it's in rose gold that is gorgeous thank you so much oh my goodness what the flip and this is where you can find her so I'll just leave this here. So this is the pink teardrop one. It goes with my nails so well. How stunning. Can you see? That's the most beautiful ring ever. Oh my gosh, I'm so in love with these. Look at this box. It's a gift box, but look. It's like a very light pink and rose gold. It is beautiful, gorgeous graphic design on this this is so thoughtful because the pink these are gonna go so nice <gasps> oh, i'm getting a bit emotional actually mm, her letter smells really nice it's weird that i'm selling it i feel like it's been sprayed with something really nice either that or her office or her business mm, it smells so good <laughs> Thank you so so much Sarah. Honestly, they are stunning. So if anyone is thinking of getting any sort of Christmas presents, I would go check her out because look at this baby. So let's move on to the next one. I really like this washi tape. How cute is this? How cute are these? They fit the package perfectly. And she's also illustrated me. And look, look who she's put in the corner. It's a little marshmallow nugget. Also, how are you guys having this amazing handwriting please give me your strength because i cannot get my handwriting to ever look this nice thank you so much nicole they are amazing and thank you for putting so much time and effort into this i'm gonna hang this in my studio i love it oh it's a handmade greetings card check this out there we go let me know how to pronounce that name and it says mystic fox if anyone wants to follow her on instagram and she sent me all these cute little kiss cut stickers which all make great planner stickers oh i love them and the next one ooh, the next one is from singapore and again you're coming at me with amazing handwriting and here she is and this business card is beautiful quality and that is her artwork how beautiful how cute these are some macaroons let me focus that for you here's some macaroons it's a lung and there's a heart as well but a medical science heart i wish i was that talented at watercolor i'm really bad at watercolors my hair looks like it's going crazy and that's it for this week um we have opened everything i hope you enjoyed it i have been very very spoiled so thank you very very much for that i hope you enjoyed this vlog i'm sorry again that the vlogs aren't as probably creative as they normally are it's just very very busy with christmas um being in full swing um thank you very much to wix for sponsoring this video it honestly means the world if you don't know i use my website with wix and i have done it from the very beginning before they even thought about sponsoring me and i am so happy with them and i actually did a video on my channel about how i design and edit my site on wix so if you want to check that out go check that out so thank you so much wix for sponsoring me you do best also i'll see so i'll see you in the next one and i'll see you in the next studio vlog i love you so so much Thank you for watching. You really are the best. I love you. All right then. Goodbye.